Welcome back to Girl Talk. We are here today at America's Best Flowers in Cottage Grove. I just love being here because regardless of the time of year, what the weather is like outside, it's always so bright in here. Mm -hmm. And, and I so always, much color. I always get my kitty fix because they have yes. kitties running around the place. So. It's so much fun. There's been a couple of times where they sneak up on you and they jump out of nowhere. <laughs> it's so much fun. Um, but with us today, we have Bill Furman. He's with William Thomas Jewelers, the owner over there. Thank you so much for being with us today. Thanks for having me. And now you guys really believe in giving back to the community. Obviously, you guys have just gorgeous jewelry over at William Thomas and really about custom jewelry is what you specialize in. But kind of thinking about giving back, you guys are actually a part of the Butterfly Gala and it's a fundraiser for a grace and that's coming up here at the end of the month. Tell me a little bit about it. It is. It's a great organization. It's October 28th. Mm -hmm. uh, it's at the Edgewater, the new Edgewater. It's been a great uh, facility for that. Um, the people involved every year uh, just do a wonderful job helping us uh, raise money for the cause. That's so wonderful and it sounds like you know not only is it a great fundraiser obviously for Grace but you are going to have the opportunity to potentially win some great jewelry. That's right uh, okay. there's a raffle. Um, okay. There's about 120 tickets being sold. Um, you have a chance to win uh, thousands of dollars in jewelry wow. and there'll be events uh, there'll be a display like what's in front of us at the event and there'll be things you can take with you or you can come in for a full jewelry experience and have something custom designed with that certificate. Oh, that is fantastic. That's so exciting. Yeah. So not only do you get to go to the Edgewater, which is beautiful, mm -hmm. right. in the fall, and it's a gala, which I mean, whatever yes. happens there, Dress you just up. get to say you get yes. to go to a gala. Okay. That's wonderful, right? And you get to be surrounded by, you know, you nice people, your beautiful business and all the things you offer and possibly win some. Yeah. Can you speak to any of the specifics that are going to be available as far as winning at the raffle or just kind of keep your eyes on the jewelry? You know, keep your eyes on the jewelry because there, there's going to be a lot of things available. Yeah. Um, and we don't like to have one piece available at fundraisers because mm -hmm. it limits the, the participants. Mm -hmm. uh, if you already have diamond earrings, then you really aren't interested. So we like to open it up to anything new. Oh, that's great. Yeah. Lots of things to look at and think yeah. about winning. Oh, <laughs> it's, it's really a fun event. Yeah. And we've been oogling over everything in front of us today. Yeah. Yeah. Is that Some a combination of ooing and ogling? <laughs> exactly. <laughs> it's I oogling. Think so. oogling. <laughs> It right here, sense. right here. Yeah, oogling, uh, I love I mean, it. You guys knew what I meant. Yeah, absolutely. Bill, have you guys done this before? We have um, for years, and I've had the company 24 years, and we have done uh, a lot of fundraising with organizations locally since the beginning of time. What um, are some of the other things that you've supported? The JDRF is a great one for me with kids. I don't um, know what that is, that's I'm the sorry. It's the Juvenile Diabetes Research Foundation. Oh, okay. Yep. Wonderful. And the Clean Lakes Alliance is a newer one. Heard of uh, Madison Lakes, I grew up water skiing in Madison on the ski team. Lakes are important to me, mm -hmm. and uh, the lakes need help here. Yes, so that's do. another cause. Thank you. <laughs> Lily's Luau is an epilepsy event that's uh, taken place for many, many years. Um, it feels really good. Oh, good. Yeah. Why is it so important for you guys to kind of give back and be, you know, a presence in the community? Just to contribute back to these great organizations yeah. uh, that they need the help. Right. Um, you know, we're just giving back as uh, support of our clientele, uh, just giving back to the community. That's so wonderful. And if you guys haven't stopped over to William Thomas Jewelers, you guys really are all about building those relationships right. and getting to know the people that walk through your door. Yeah, it's, uh, I was just saying to someone earlier, it's much more the experience mm -hmm. of coming in our store and people come in and it's, it's custom, it's high end and they're a little nervous. And yeah. once they get talking with us, they recognize immediately that there's no guard. Yeah. Um, they can be comfortable. Um, Everyone can afford something in our store. Totally. Uh, it's a great experience. It's a definitely small, intimate experience, mm -hmm. too, versus yeah. the really large stores where you yeah. get, get a little lost, maybe. Right. Yeah. And weren't you inspired by your grandfather? Right. Uh, I grew up in a jewelry background. My grandparents had a store in New London, Wisconsin, that I spent many days after school just watching him do his thing. And I knew I wanted to do this since I was probably nine. Oh, that's wow. great. And you're doing so much more yeah. than just the jewelry by yeah. helping with these other causes. Too. I've been fortunate. Mm -hmm. yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. I think the first time I met you, Bill, I walked in and it was a mother and it must have been her mother. Yes. So grandmother and her daughter coming yeah. in together. I mean, just what a cool way to get to know people and their families yeah. and help them create something memorable. Yeah. It's been nice. It. We appreciate Fantastic. the no the no intimidation feeling <laughs> yeah. in the store because well, people do get intimidated they in do. jewelry right. stores. It's very overwhelming and it makes you not really want to do it. Takes the fun out of it. Yeah. yeah. How yeah. cool yeah. that you can walk into William Thomas Jewelers and you're actually there. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, the owners. You're there actually there working with hands. people and, yeah. and helping them. So. We'll take good care of you. That's yeah. pretty fantastic. Thank you. Again, right. Bill Furman with William Thomas Jewelers. Thank you so much for being with us today. Thank you. And be sure to stop by the Butterfly Gala on October 28th at the Edgewater Hotel. And we're Girl Talk, and we'll be right back here at America's Best Flowers after this.